What's up, YouTube? It's your man, King Dev, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're jumping into episode 12 of Mob Psycho 100 Season 2. Last time, you know, a lot of bit battles between the Ultimate Five and our, you know, our group of people who are trying to, you know, overthrow or get rid of um, the Claw. But yeah, at the end of the episode, we basically got Mob who finally appeared, and he basically told everyone that you're all injured. I don't want anyone else to get hurt. That's the scariest thing that could happen. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to do this on my own. I'm going to be hard on people. I'm going to be hard on y'all right now. And I'm telling y'all, no, you can't come with me. I'm a, I got to do this on my own just so I can protect you guys. All right. So then he entered the headquarters. He was he encountered Sirizawa, who is um the member of the Ultimate Five that I believe that the boss trusts the most. But I'm not sure. But listen, he's definitely going to be a strong dude. He easily blocked shows three months of stored power with his umbrella. So I'm sure he's going to be a tough opponent to fight. But I got faith in my guy, Mob. And I feel like he's going to overcome and then we're going to get to see the boss 1v1 mob versus boss man. So um, with that being said, I'm not going to talk too much more because I just want to get into this. If you're watching this, then you know I always do the last two episodes of series on the same day. So by the time you're watching this, know that if you come back in 30 minutes after this uploads, that the second episode or the finale will be available. So um, yeah, let's jump into episode 12. And like I said, come back 30 minutes and you can see the finale. Also, before we get started, I just want to I just want to let you guys know that this this episode starts with the opening. Usually, there's a scene, and then we get to open it, and then we get the show. This one, no scene before, just straight opening, which means things are gonna go down this episode, and I'm looking forward to it. That's all I wanted. To, I just wanted to throw that in there. So, um, yeah, let's jump in episode twelve. Let's go. The battle for social rehabilitation, friendship, and then we go Ma versus Serizawa. Let's do it. And we took he gave me back the Prime Minister. I forgot all about Prime Minister. This dude is clueless. He like, bro, I just talked to Prime Minister. Bro, Prime Minister ain't even gonna have no job after if y'all succeed. So why are you so so hyped? Hey, he pulled me out of hell. Put me into this heavenly place. That's his right-hand man. 27 years old. But I don't look like hell. I mean, it look a little, um, depressing, but your mother asked me to help get you a job and get you out my got her goddamn house. <laughs> hey, but I'm going to teach you to embrace them powers because I like them. I got powers, too. <laughs> you feel me? I got powers too. You're not alone. Come with me. This dude doing the whole Orochimaru thing right now. Hey, as long as you're with me, you always good. <laughs> Even I can tell that's wrong. Aren't you just a tool right now? Yeah, it's, it's kind of ironic that Mob's the one who can see through this, but, you know, his, given his situation, which is extremely similar to some degree, it's just, it's just ironic. <laughs> like, you a kid, I don't want to hurt you, but he, he don't even know what he about to get into. Oh, he called the president like the president ain't the one. You picked the wrong one. Dimple, don't get hit by that, bro. I, I got, I, I, I'm concerned for your safety. I don't know if you'll be able to. That umbrella is bulletproof. Hit him. <laughs> did he drop a rock one? Whoa, whoa, it got powers in it. So what did he add, like, like weight onto it? Damn, he stabbed him with it. This dude's so kind, though. <laughs> oh man, that's his, that's his freak out. He lost his umbrella, so he freaked out, and when he freaks out, he, he got even more power. It's a false piece, bro. Like I said, the parallel is kind of what happened earlier with with Reagan. These are exact words Reagan said. He kind of he kind of tried to cage in mob. Hey, he knows better than anybody at this point. Talk to him, mob. That's all you gotta do. We might get through this fight without getting physically physically harmed. Watch he about to join Mob's religion. I don't want to see that. <laughs> yeah. 
this situation is extremely familiar for my Hey, I got real friends. That's how I know you got fake friends. It's it's quite apparent. Your friends real friends don't do this. This is a good episode. This doesn't even have to be a physical fight. We're going to be fighting with the words. Give him truth. Some peace. Mob going to explode. Friendship explosion? Friendship explosion. This that, this that, this, is this the power of love? Can I, can I get a power of love, please? It's probably not love. It's probably friendship. <laughs> he embracing all, all your hostility and your pain. He's gonna get rid of it. And I'm gonna be your friend at the end of the day, bro. Because we just alike. You see this glorious energy, bro? This is what a friend is. Oh, he's seeing his past and his feelings and everything Mob went through. His experience. He can see that y'all got things in... Exactly. Y'all are extremely alike. They similarities. And that, that was their bonding moment right there. Damn, show got ripped for real. Okay. And this is like straight up My Hero Academia one for all, all for one. My man can stockpile energy and he can give out powers. What is this? I wonder if they're going to come back now. And that's just a fraction. He can give 600 people energy, but that's a fraction of his true power. And now he's going to take it back. He taking back all his secret sauce. Give me all my sauce. Damn. He's just energy. He's pure energy, bro. This dude gonna explode one day. He said, oh, I can be the only, I'm the true protagonist. No, you're not. Reagan is. Whoa. Ma made it up. Interesting. Yeah. Cause series I was too nice. He kind hearted as hell for a low key. Let's be honest. Right. We bonded. We became friends. That's it. You know, we had a heartfelt conversation. Got to know the dude, and he's a cool dude, and you was using him. So now he's on my side. He's rocking with me. Hey, that's what's up. I don't want happiness if it gotta throw, you know, other people down. Look at him. No remorse. He said it, though. He wouldn't care if he lost all his allies. That's what I'm saying. Who hurt him? Because somebody must have did something really drastic to him. This dude basically all for one. He just gave him some power. He gave him the power to get up out of here. Whoa! He said, you the enemy now. I'm getting active. Show, go home. Wow, he got potential to be the mortal enemy. Damn, knocked his ass out. How you knock a spirit unconscious? Right, one of his many qualities. He's a great dude as well. Mm. He just learned that. He developed that this season. Expressing himself a lot more openly. Look at Dimple floating down like a feather. Goodbye. Well, you already did. Look at the mark on the, the surrounding area. There is nothing. You marked the earth. You can go home now. Get him, Mob. He tripping. Don't talk to your son like that. Uh-oh. They turned up that music. I'm immersed. Turning my mic all the way up. 
Come on, Mop. Yeah, you knew this was going to be a tough fight, but come on. Come on. Damn, he breaking through. Damn. All right, let's do it. Come on, Mop. Mop, we knew we was coming into this. Come on. Show, stop getting involved, please. You can't help. You're just going to be a distraction. Mop. Mop. Come on. God damn, one hit? Whoa, he got straps. With real bullets. This time, this ain't no toy. まだ私のおそろしさが理解できんだし。おい、生きてるかモブ。辛いそうなやつだよ。どういう意味だ。人がもつ優れた力ってのは超能力だけじゃないって言ってた。Right。お前を倒す方法もざっと思いつくだけで